Hi, I'm Steve Newman and welcome to Intection. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Canon XA30 Professional Camcorder. So, okay, the Canon XA30. So I haven't opened this yet, so this is the first. So let's have a look. So it comes in a, a pretty basic box. Nothing much to see, nothing on the sides. Just says it's high definition. Yeah, so nothing really much to see. So let's have a look. So if we open it up, aha, uh -huh. so what we've got in here, we have, now that's who I bought it from, from a good company called Wex Photography. Uh, let's move that out of the way. Okay, we that's my invoice. Yep, we don't need to see any of that. Let's move that out of the way. Got various Canon warranty things. Yep, yeah, let's move that out of the way. Yep, loads of warranty. A, we have obviously a camcorder. It looks like a manual of some kind. Yep, yeah, so a nice manual for another time. A really thick manual. Right, okay. Yet another manual. Wow. Uh, a got a pack with a CD and various other things. I think we're, we'll look at that later. I have, this is the model with the extra battery. So that's an extra Canon battery. So let's have a look at that. Okay, so there you go. Uh, an extra Canon battery, which will come in handy. So we'll put that there. Okay. Uh, a, this is a UK power adapter. Okay, so underneath here, what else have we got? So we have, okay, let's have a look. So in here, let's just tack that under there. All right, okay. So in here we have a, what looks like, oh, another power adapter for European, yeah, or American, not sure what country that is, but there we go. Another power adapter, put that down there. We have what looks like, let's open this, a oh, HDMI cable, uh, full size, and that looks like a mini HDMI on this end, so that's pretty good. So let's put that down there. What else we got? This is the other battery that comes with the camera, so that's another battery. So that's pretty cool. So we'll put that down there We're next to that one. There is a looking at this um, small little battery which must be for remote or something. So we'll put that down there. We have the remote that the battery probably belongs to. We have some screws. We'll have a look at those in a moment. We have ah a lens cover, which we'll put on there as well. We also have um, some some audio cables, some video cables here. Um, there's also a USB micro USB to USB cable there as well. Uh, ah, we have a filter which goes around a cable. Okay. We also have a power adapter. I think really special there. We also have ah, this is the microphone attachment. It's on the top here. Okay, so put that there. And what else we got in here? Oh, hold on. Then we have here, which is really good. This is definitely pretty cool. So this is the professional uh, handle that sits on the top. As you can see, it's got XLR inputs. Uh, you've got some controls on the side to control the camera, tele, tele and wide, hot shoe. Uh, and then on, as you can see here, there's also some more audio controls on this side, even phantom power and so on. So that's pretty cool. So we'll put that down there. I've still got to fit that. Um, on this side of the box, doesn't look like there's anything else in there, so we'll leave that. 
And of course, on this side of the box, there's nothing else in here, I don't think. So we take the box away. All right. So here, all right, so here is the camera itself. So let's just move this out of the way. So we have in here the camera itself. So there we go. So this is the new Sony High Definition XA professional video camera. Now what's really cool about this is, I mean I've not put anything on it, but you can see with taking off everything that's there, it is really small. So that is you know, that is a very small handheld camera as well. So that's pretty cool. So what we're going to do is quickly uh, see how to fit this. And uh, I'll put this all together and then uh, I'll get back to you and show you what the camera looks like with all its components on rather than, uh, well, I'll do that now and then we can speed it up and have a look. So let's have a look. So let's quickly put this on. I mean, this looks really easy actually. So let's put this on here. And I probably should read the manual, but let's have a look. Right, so let's do that. Let's have a look. Tighten that up. So now we have that fitted. So this, like it, this is where the screws come in. So, of course, I'll fit that later. So let's have a look where it goes. So, okay, so this fits up here in that location, right? So, interesting. So, I would have thought it would have fitted differently. This rubber, so this is rubber and it fits like so, like that. And then you fit those little screws that are in here onto it which I'll, I'll do later on. Okay, so there's the camera. So let's now quickly put all this on. So this is the lens hood. So we take that off. Um, one lens hood. So there we go. So that's the camera with the lens hood. Okay, so that is the camera. Let's see if it works. So we'll put on the rest of the stuff later. So if we go and find a, one of the batteries and see if there's any power in it. So let's have a quick look and we power it on. So the battery itself fits in here at the bottom. Okay, uh, and it has a screen at the side, which looks pretty cool. Um, this door here holds the SD cards. Yeah, so I've got a couple of SD cards to put in. So we'll go through this in more detail, um, but yeah, it looks pretty cool. So let's just quickly fire this on. And then what I'll do is I'll do a separate video uh, just showing my first impressions uh, of using the camera. Um, but for now, let's just quickly see if it powers on and then we're, we'll call that quits. So let's power the camera on let's see if we can figure it out without even re reading any of the manuals interesting so i'm looking all around the camera for a power button um good question where's the power button you'd like to think it's somewhere camera ah ah Right, so I've just tried switching it on and not unsurprisingly, there's no power in the camera. So I'll have to charge that up. Good point. So we shall go and do that in a moment. What else have we got? Uh, let's just try the other battery and we'll see whether that one's got any power as well. So let's have a look. 
that we let's just see put the other camera on battery on and no so that's got no power so we need to charge these up okay so that's the camera as it is so um i'm quite impressed with that so thank you very much for watching and uh, please subscribe